I'm going to show you how to make takoyaki, the number one Japanese street food. These are grilled balls containing octopus. Start by kneading half pound of octopus with salt for three minutes. This helps tenderize the flesh and also cleans it. Then rinse them well. Put one tablespoon of salt in a pot of boiling water. Cook the octopus in it for five minutes over medium heat. Then take them out. Prepare the butter in a mixing bowl. Beat one egg with one quarter teaspoon of salt. I prepared three cups of water. Add a little. Put one tablespoon of dashi powder and half tablespoon of light soy sauce. Mix. Then add one cup of all-purpose flour, half cup of rice flour and half teaspoon of baking powder. Mix. Gradually add the rest of the water while mixing. The butter is liquid. Let it rest while continuing the preparation. Now, prepare the takoyaki sauce. In a bowl, put 1 teaspoon of dashi powder, half tablespoon of light soy sauce, 1 tablespoon of oyster sauce, 2 tablespoons of barbecue sauce, and 1 teaspoon of sugar. Combine and keep aside. Mince 2 spring onions, 1 tablespoon of pecan ginger, Cut the octopus into small chunks. Prepare the tonkatsu. There are small flakes of fried butter. For this, in a bowl, mix 5 tablespoons of all-purpose flour with 5 tablespoons of water and a pinch of salt. Heat the oil to 250 degrees. Over low heat, use creamer to drop the butter. Be careful. If the oil is too hot, you risk a splashing. Separate the flakes with chopsticks. Let them fry for 4 minutes. Take them out. Transfer the takoyaki butter into a container for pouring. This is a takoyaki pan. It allows you to obtain round bones. It has no teeth to stabilize over the gas stove. Heat it over medium heat. Generously cut the hollows and on the surface with a vegetable oil. When it is hot, mix the butter before pouring it. Fill the hollows overflowing over all the surface. Garnish with the octopus. The tonkatsu flakes, they will give consistency and bring a little crunch. Also add the pecan ginger and the spring onion. Let cook for one minute so that the butter thickens. Hand on the takoyaki with long skewits. Cut the dough along the separation of the pan. Rotate each takoyaki a little, bringing the dough and the fillings together towards the inside. The bowl are not yet formed. They will become rounded gradually during cooking. Regularly rotate each bowl a little. After 11 to 12 minutes, they are nicely browned and toasted. The takoyaki are ready. Take them out. Sprinkle them with the sauce, the bonito flakes, and the nori seaweed flakes. You can also add some mayonnaise. Enjoy them warm. Be careful, they can be very hot inside. Takoyaki are a complete meal. 
Bon appétit Inside, the takoyaki are soft and moist. This contrasts with their toasted crust. The rice flour brings lightness and more toasted flavor and also texture to the takoyaki. Thank you. See you at the next homemade dish on Morgan Recipes.